Hello, my name is Lauren Bavitz fields and I'm a family law attorney on the domestic litigation team at Roth Davies LLC. Today we'll be discussing move away cases. If you have a parenting time order and you would like to leave, or the other parent would like to leave the state or even the city, you have to provide the other party 30 days certified mail written notice of your intent to move the address of the child. This is an important notification tool to give the other party notice to either fight your move or try to work out some sort of different custodial relationship. If you are trying to contest the move of another parent with that child, the, the judge has specific remedies to look at. The judge will first consider the effect of the move on the child. They will consider, does the child need to be pulled out of school? Will they be pulled out of extracurricular activities? Will they be changed from a friend group and a peer group that they know and trust? The second factor that they look at is what is the effect on the move of the non-custodial parent? So this is the parent that is staying in the jurisdiction. Will they have to travel to see the child? Will they have to be on a plane to see the child? These are factors that the court will consider whether they will let the parent move with the child or not. As we touched on just briefly, the third factor is the cost of the move. What will that travel arrangements look like? Are you going to be moving 30 minutes away with the child or are you moving three hours away from the child? The judge will take this into consideration whether they let the parent move with the child or not. Oftentimes, move away cases can be very difficult, especially if you're taking the child away from a hometown. If you have any questions about these move away cases, please call Roth Davies at 913-451-9500. Thank you.